Hello everybody, Conti here with another video. How to use the splitter and combiner nodes in the color window of DaVinci Resolve 16.2 to divide the red, green and blue channels of a video or picture file so that these can be modified individually with color corrections in the software. Inside my edit window, I already have my MP4 file on my timeline. I'm going to go down and click on the color tab at the bottom of my screen. Inside the nodes window at the top of your screen, right click on the grid where your video node appears. Ensure when you right click, do not right click on the video node itself. Go to add node and select splitter. Break the line connecting your video or image node to your output by left clicking on the section of the line closer to your output node. Left click, hold your mouse button down on the top right green box which appears on your video node. Drag your mouse cursor to the green triangle which appears to the left of your new splitter node. Note how in this splitter node, red is at top, green is in the middle and blue is at the bottom, illustrating the color channels that each of these boxes will be connected to. Right click on the grid once more, go to add node and corrector. Repeat this process a further two more times so that you have three corrector nodes all together inside your nodes interface. The corrector node representing the red channel for my video file will be placed at the top here. I'm going to left click on the box in the top right corner which represents this red color and connect this to the triangle in the top left corner of my corrector node and repeat the same process for the green and blue nodes also. Right click on the grid once again, go to add node and combiner. This node will be used to combine all three color channels, red, green and blue together into one, which will then be fed through to the output node at the end of your nodes grid. I'm going to drag this to the right and I'll connect the combiner node to the output first of all. Using the same node connecting technique as I did when I connected the node representing my original video file here to the splitter node in the middle, I'm going to left click on the green square in the top right corner of the corrector node representing the red channel. Bear in mind that the order of the red, green and blue channels inside the combiner node are the same as that in the splitter node. Red on top, green in middle and blue at the bottom. Therefore, I want the corrector node representing the red channel of my video connected to the top triangle here. The corrector representing the green channel is connected to the middle and the blue channel corrector is connected at the bottom. If I were to now select the corrector which represents the blue channel of my video and go to select the color wheels option towards the bottom of my color window and adjust the lift option which concentrates on the darker areas of an image or video file. We can see that the darker sky and sea colors have been intensified as a result of me moving the circle in the middle of the rainbow ring towards the blue shade on the side here. For user friendliness, you can also label each of the nodes here so that you can see better which color each of the correctors represents by right clicking and going to node label and typing in the color channel, for example. And now you are able to modify the red, green and blue channels individually using the color window. Thank you very much for watching. I hope that video was useful to you. If you enjoyed the content and wish to be notified about future uploads on this channel, please like and subscribe. Join me soon for another video. Take care.